In today's video, I will be showing how to use an electric sander to take the old oil off a wooden worktop. For this job, you will need an electric surface sander along with a rougher grade sandpaper and a softer grade sandpaper. We recommend 60 to 100 grit for the first few passings and then 120 to 180 grit for the final passing. If your sander has a 110 volt plug, then you will need a transformer. All the equipment mentioned in this video are available on the Frankie Tool Hire website. So the first step is to completely clear your worktop of any obstructions and then you can start with the surface preparation. So to start off, I used a methylated spirit to help me remove some of the old grease and oil from the worktop just to release it and make it a little bit easier for the sander. So I used a damp cloth with the spirit just to dilute it slightly and then I used the cloth just in circular motions to rub the solution into the wood. So you might be wondering why I'm not using a scraper to do this job. Now, scrapers do work if you have a very flat worktop, but for the texture of this oak worktop, a scraper would not be ideal. Now it's best to make sure that the worktop fully dries up before you start sanding, because if you sand a wet worktop, it will easily clog up the sandpaper and it can also damage the wood. Now it's time to fit the sandpaper. Remember you need to use the rough grit first. This will remove the top layer of wood that all of the oil is soaked into. Simply move the clip as shown, then fit one end of the sandpaper into the slot and then secure the clip back to hold the sandpaper in place. Repeat this on the other side as well. Once you start actually using the sander, it's important to move with the grain of the wood to avoid as much damage as possible to the actual surface of the wood itself. While you're using the sander, if you start to feel less resistance, it probably means it's time to scrape off some of the residue off the sandpaper. Now remember, once you've done this a few times, the sandpaper will actually lose a lot of its grit and the paper will need replacing with a new sheet. Now remember, if you live in the UK, you can hire all the equipment mentioned in this video in the description on the Frankie Tool Hire website. For your last pass with the sander, we recommend switching over to 120 to 180 grit sandpaper just to get a nice smooth finish. To make the job a bit easier, I recommend that you use a dustpan and brush just to clean up as you're going around the worktop. If you want to know how to oil your worktop, click the card in the top right of the video to go over to the Charles Watson's YouTube channel. Remember to give us a like if you found this video useful and leave a comment if you have any questions left unanswered.